Hey everybody, welcome back. Ordinary Average Bob here, continuing my playthrough of Dark Souls 2. We're in the Shrine of Amana at the first, uh, second rather bonfire, getting ready to take on the first boss of this area, the Demon of Song. Let's do this! Hey everybody, welcome back! Yeehaw! All right, now before I head, we're at, here's the, here's the second bonfire, okay? And this is where all the acid beetles were. Before I head down that hallway, I'm gonna go back and get the summon partner, so she can help me with this next part. So we'll be right back. All right, so here's Felicia. And for those of you who don't remember, let me let me backtrack. I probably maybe should have showed it, but uh, she is back in that house back there. So, uh, you know, just make sure you're human. Her summon sign's in there. Come on, Felicia. Let's go. Now, you do want to be careful. This area up here is quite hazardous. There's lots of those, uh, well, spellcasters for one thing. Here we go. There's one firing at me already, so let's take her out. Ugh. Take the hit. I'll block the other one. <laughs> so, she's not the only one. Let's see, where's the next one? I know there's at least two out there. Oh, I know there's one around this corner here. So we'll head around this corner. Walk against the rocks or else you'll fall off the edge. Ah, like I almost did, oh my god. Don't fall off, Felicia, get back here. Get back here. Don't follow me. Oh, don't be stupid. Let's see, now here's another. There's one of the magic users right there. Let's take her out and there's one more. Oh, she didn't get hit by that. Cool. But it's it's in there. I want to... Let's see. If I stay here... There she is. I'm being very careful that I don't bump my joystick here because I don't want to fall. I'm right on the edge. Oh, come on. Cereal! Ah, you got to take her out, man. Before you... Uh, because she will start wailing on you in there. We're going to get invaded. Come on. Dude. I know I can do this. This got to be it. There we go. Alright. Whew. Okay. So that should take care of all the magic users out there. Now there are several little hiding monsters in here. So you want to be careful of that. Felicia is working on here and sucking at it. Uh, so don't go too far into the middle so you don't attract them. But what's going to happen is we're going to get invaded here in a minute. There it is. All right. Now this guy, oh, he sucks. So he will, he uses dark magic. Wait, wait, we don't want to go around there because that's, whew, that's bad. So let's see. I'm going to, hopefully she will entertain him while I try to pin him. He is very difficult though. Uh, I'd run out there, but the uh, bad guys are going to, all those stupid, uh, all those stupid troglodyte dudes are hiding in the water. So let's see, maybe I can take him out while she's keeping him busy. Ah, he's so... And that, the other part that sucks about this metal is you're so slow walking in the water, and he's trying to lure you over to where the stupid monsters are hiding. There's one. Let's take him out. Felicia is keeping him busy, which is nice. See if I can get him. Come here, you! Ah, oh, you're such a wuss. I think the last time I actually made him fall off the made him fall off the ledge. Oi. There we go. Ugh. Oh, banish him. And I think Felicia will leave now. At least I hope she will, because I don't want her to help me with the boss fight, because it's really easy. So we get this. We gotta get this item out here. Oh, thank you. Be careful walking out around this ledge. 
This is very small. Alright. Now let's go pick up the rest of the items in here. Felicia, get out of my way. Get out of my way! Oh my god, are you kidding me? There we go. I'd be okay if you fell down and died. I don't need you. I don't need you! I don't need anybody! <laughs> Human effigy, and then outside of the cave here, there was another item. Let's go get it. I apologize, my efficiency here is not very good. Alright. That's all the items. Felicia, get out of the way! Aye. You're annoying. Alright. Let's see, now I think... Uh, I think we're okay here. Here's a little house. This is the house we used to live in. Now, let's head on through the house. And here's another Milfinito. Let's talk to her. And she just goes away. And that's alright. Uh, that's what you want. I wonder if I could make her go away. Let's see. I'm gonna try something. Banish phantoms. Let's see. Can I... Send you home. Bye, F oh cool, I can do that. Bye, Felicia! Yes. Have a nice day. Alright, I don't want her in here because this boss is really easy and I don't need the extra difficulty. So here we go! The Demon of Song! It's a giant frog thing with a creepy face. <clears throat> now, this guy is really easy. You want to just kind of stay in close proximity to him. And he's got these little fists. So you can't hurt him when he's all shelled up like that, but when he comes out, don't, you know, swat. Oh! He's already starting out with a big one, huh? Nice. So that right there, you want to roll out of the way, because you can't really block it, uh, or it'll take all your stamina. It's pretty powerful. And then this, let's see. Oh my god, he's doing it again. Ay! Oh, he hit me that time. Did not get, did not get a good, uh, Oh my god, are you kidding me? Wow. He is, uh, he's being rather stupid today. Alright, come on. Oh my god! <laughs> Alright, there's another attack. Uh, obviously, he has lots of recovery time. So, when he stops his attack, then you can go in and get a hit or two. Here we go. There's a normal attack. A couple of smacks. Chop, chop. He has a couple of projectile attacks also. Little water spits. Uh, we'll see if he does those. Oh, my goodness. Well, that's new. I will just back away. I will ask this up. Oh, my... <sighs> okay. Just like Dark Souls, you think it's easy, and it's I beat this guy with no problem. He didn't do any of those attacks, at least very few of them the first time I fought him, so let's see if we can do this again. This is not a difficult boss battle, but you've seen a lot of what he does already. I've never seen him do that shooting thing across uh, across the water. Uh, the one thing that's good about this area that you don't have to worry about is falling down into something deep, because it's all shallow, so you don't have to worry about that. So just maintain your distance. Come on, buddy. Oh, here we go. There's a projectile attack. Although I didn't get in close enough to get any hits on him there. Come on. There's a grab. He tried. And failed that. I've never seen that either. The first time I fought him, all he did was shoot projectile weapons and do this. Smash! Smash! That was it. 
and then an occasional stand up and like you know plummet down like uh oh that now that jumping attack does have an area of effect that you do want to kind of watch out for Ugh. Uh, so yeah, so be careful on that one. I was able to get three hits on that. That's nice. Smash. Smash. Couple of hits. Piece of cake. Smash. Smash. Oh, I could have got a third one in there. I chickened out. There we go. Oh! No! Dude, two-handed! Smash! 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 Ooh, got you good! Got you good, demon! You're gonna get her next time! Oh, really? Oh, yeah! See? That's it! I cannot believe that guy killed me. That is so sad. I'll get my souls. Oh! Now, what you didn't see there, probably because I clicked too fast, was we got his soul, obviously, and then we got the key to the embedded. Now we can go do that as soon as I find... Let's see, here's the cave to get out of here. Now we're going to go find another bonfire, I believe. Nope. Yes? Yeah, this is the right way. Okay. Yeah, there's a bonfire up here eventually. Uh, and we'll use that key of the embedded. I don't know. You guys probably remember uh, at the top of... Let's see. Castle Drang Lake. There was... Uh, a, a guy that was sort of ball gagged against a, a, a cage that had another Milfanito girl in it. Uh, that's where we're going to use that. So this right here door is to the next area. Uh, we're not going to go in there quite yet though. We're going to head around this this way. Excuse me. Be careful. You uh, don't want to walk off. Here's a chest. Right next to the edge. The edge of glory. Magic arrows. Oh, here's a bonfire. And we'll go ahead and light it. Uh, but we're not done here yet. Head on up the stairs. Right up the stairs. Up the stairs. Let's see. Nope. We're gonna go through these doors. Okay. Oh! I forgot about these guys! Ah! Uh, see, I wanna change my weapon real fast. No, not that one. Oh, I don't want that one. <laughs> Hang on. I need I need my bastard sword. Where is it? There we go. Fire bastard sword, that'll work. Just so I can chop down on these guys. No! What is that? Because I'm not locked on? I I I don't know why it's Oh, it's because I'm two-handing it. There we go. Chop! Oy vey. Way to screw that up, Bob. Big dummy. Alright, back to the claymore. There's only those three. Now there is a prowling magus. Remember, uh, he was one of the bosses in Brightstone Cove. See him way up there? Let's go see if we can uh, take him out. The last time I used a bunch of arrows on him. Oops. Uh oh. We're gonna run out of stamina. Oh, quick, get him back! <laughs> Woo! Okay. Woo! Yeah, he did not hurt me too bad. Yay. Let's, uh, we'll talk to this. We'll come back upstairs and talk to this girl in a second. We wanna head downstairs, though. Get a couple of items. And here is one. There it is. A fire seed. Nice. Now there's a couple of chests here. So, first one, I believe. Let's see. Let's walk. Yeah, here we go. Walk on the edge. Just be careful because the edge is right there. You don't want to fall off and die. Mm. 
bonfire aesthetic. <laughs> and the second one is, let's see, is this it? It's up here. There we go. The man's there! <laughs> uh, I think they're... Nope, no item back there. Okay, never mind. Alright, so that's that. Let's go head back and talk to that woman. Be careful of the ledge. Oh, Siren, you sing so beautifully. Do you sing for the little children? I do sing for the little children. There she is. Talk. Who are you? And what do you want from us? Milfanito. That is what we are called. Do you mean our name? We know nothing of the outside world. We sing eternally for those who bear death and dark within themselves. We have been here forever. We know nothing of the outside world, and we do not need to. The little ones were born from the great dead one, and the great dead one taught us song. We have sung ever since, <laughs> to comfort those bound by death and dark. Oh, how nice. This is what we were taught. You silenced that cursed singing. The frog? Please accept these as a thank you. I wonder if he was singing, Hello my baby, hello my honey, hello my ragtime gal. Do you see comfort too? Yes, please comfort me. You poor thing. Look at my face. Take this at the very least. Smooth and silky stones. This is all that we can do. Is it? Is there all you want to do? The little one. Alright. No. And the great. I think that's. Yes. This is what we were taught. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. So, again, talk to her. She'll give you a couple of items. Now, you can use this. Let's see. You can use this altar to pray. Like, I'll hit it, but nothing will happen. Okay. And that is because uh, I have the ability to make myself human. If you are completely out of human effigies, you don't have any in your item box... Uh, then you can use this shrine as many times as you want to to make yourself human again uh, without costing you anything. I don't even think it costs souls. So it's free, but it only works if you don't have any other means of making yourself human. So that's that. All right, let's head on back over to that bonfire, and we'll pop on over to Castle Drang Lake. All right, so here we are, Drang Lake Castle. We'll head on down to the elevator. Take us up, Johnny. And here, <laughs> here he is. <laughs> it's Kenny. Hey, Kenny. Your life uh, has gone in a really, really bad direction, hasn't it? <laughs> Shut up. The key is a sword. Uh, well, that was brutal, man. But it's open now. Hello, Milfanito. Ring of the Dead. All right, so I think uh, I think now's a good time to stop this video. Bye. See you next time. All right, so there it is, the Shrine of Amana. I cannot believe the Demon of Song killed me, but uh, just like any other boss, every once in a while they pull out these really surprising moves and it completely destroys you. Uh, I had never seen that one before, so it kind of caught me off guard. But whatever. In the end, he's a really easy boss really easy so you don't need any help for that one take them out yourself be a man if you like what you saw today go ahead and push that like button if you got any comments or suggestions feel free to put them below in the comment section and as always please 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 don't forget to hit that subscribe button 
down there on the bottom, hit that subscribe button and become a subscriber today. I would greatly appreciate it. Until next time, peace out. Smell you later!